What some consider hidden history in Houston is not so hidden anymore. From the writer-director who collaborated with Spike Lee on movies like The Five Bloods and Black Klansmen comes a special project. It's about police brutality and rioting in Houston more than 100 years ago that is sadly still relevant nationwide. Sprawling modern day Memorial Park with its trails, trees and a well cared for golf course was once the backdrop for military operations. Camp Logan served as a training camp for World War I soldiers from 1917 to 1919. It's a little known story that's come to light in a new film, The 24th. Men of the 24th Infantry, this is Texas. The movie features history that is as dark and troubled as those times. Jim Crow's the law, respect. The film follows the all-black 3rd Battalion, 24th Infantry, a unit of the celebrated Buffalo Soldiers sent to Houston to guard the construction at Camp Logan. When these 700 black soldiers show up in Houston, Jim Crow is, is alive and well. It's, and you gotta remember, it's a new thing. And these soldiers had fought in, in the Spanish-American War, had gone up San Juan Hill, had fought in the Philippines. They weren't, they weren't used to being treated as second-class citizens. The film, written and directed by Kevin Wilmot, shows how the men of the 24th were subjected to police brutality and awful acts of racism, despite their service to their country. The police brutalize us, sir. All we want is to be treated as soldiers. When some of the men of the 24th suspect one of their own has come under attack by Houston police officers and possibly killed, they march on the city of Houston while also taking up arms to protect themselves from what they believe to be an angry mob of white residents. Mutiny and rioting ensued. 16 people, mostly civilians, were killed by the soldiers. Fire! Their crimes led to the soldiers' court martial, the largest murder trial in U.S. history. Almost 30 years ago, I saw the photograph of the, of the trial. It blew my mind. Here are these 63 black soldiers surrounded by white soldiers with fixed bayonets on their rifles. And the caption said, the largest murder trial in American history. And I had never heard anything about it. And so when I looked into the story, I, I thought it was a, a fascinating story and one that Americans really needed to know because more than anything, it's an American story. As tragic as that story may be, in the end, all but eight of 118 soldiers charged were convicted and 19 soldiers were hanged for their part in the Houston riot of 1917. I hope people see this as not a downer for Houston, but an opportunity to understand who we are better. Seeing the film may be just the start. The 24th is playing on demand and is also streaming. 